kids and welcome back on the brick show so i am in the survival world that i was last time and it is in a, the plastic texture pack which is one of my favorite texture packs okay so out of episode oh it was just a mess i was trying to get some bones like a normal person just trying to get another dog but like i was just getting the bones part because it was, it was a mess and i went over this way and a lot of monsters spawn in that biome so i went out and I tried killing a skeleton, and then I died. And then trying to get back to my stuff, a lot of things blew up, as you can see here. And it was it was a mess. So, yeah, we don't have another dog. I ended up getting, like, one bone, but that's not really going to do much. And so, I obviously, the one of the main reasons why is I don't have good enough tools or armor to be able to do that. So, we're going to be mining today, and I already made some boots, as you can see, they are on me right now, and we are not bringing our dog down, because that's dangerous. But when terraforming this area, because I made it look a lot nicer than it was before, I just put down some dirt, there was a cave that I covered up, and while trying to complete the floors, I found it. So we are going to go down this cave, hopefully, it's a good cave, hopefully, well, well, it's definitely not a good cave. But, it did have a few minerals and iron stuff that we can use to make better armor and stuff, which is not that bad. So, I'm just going to go find a different cave, because I really don't like strip mining. That's kind of annoying. So yeah, we're just going to do that. Um, I know there's a plains biome across like the river, and I've always found that's a really good place for caves. So we're going to head over that way. Ooh, more iron I almost missed. That would have, well, it wouldn't have been that bad, but I would just had less iron than I would. So already we can make a chest plate, a sword, some nice armor. Hopefully we can get like a complete set, but we'll keep our boots leather and we'll dye them pink because pink is the best color in the world, according to me, though. A lot of people disagree. What is that? That's not another cave. That's just a fault in the ground. Okay, so we're going to head across there, and there's a bit of a plains biome. Hopefully, there will be some caves. If not, we can head over um, towards the acacia biome that we live next to, or the one across there. We just need somewhere a good place to mine. We don't even need, like, a great place. We don't need a place with, like, diamonds everywhere, and gold, and lapis. Not yet. We will eventually. But we don't need it yet, so we just need to get a okay mine that goes deep enough so we have a good enough materials to be able to live more. Is this all the plains biome that it is? We're not going to find a great cave here at all. Ooh. Just curious. I don't think this is an actual cave, but this place looks cool. It's like floating and stuff. There's no falling sand that could possibly hurt me though. That that would be. Oh, okay. We'll just put down some torches. I know that's sandstone. Oh, this is so cool. I know it was a complete waste of torches, so we're probably gonna take some of these back. We don't need these. We're gonna keep those there because it's turning night. Is it? No, no, it's not. I don't know why, but like, when you're when I'm playing at least, um, I it'll be like. A normal, maybe like midday, but for some odd reason it just seems darker than it was in the past, and so I think, I want to be by this falling down, that it's like turning night, but it's not, it's not even close to night. Oh, this looks better, except it doesn't end here. Oops, zombies. Let's just get rid of this issue. Ooh. Okay. I found some coal. We can get this coal up, and then we can go take on the zombies, because I definitely heard the zombies. Okay, I think we'll be fine. We have a sword. If it's a spawner, though, we will not be fine. Hopefully it's not a spawner. Hopefully. Oh, sorry. Hopefully. Okay, so we need our shovel. Oh, my put our lapis there and we're gonna go from a high ground so let's grab some of this dirt we don't need all these pickaxes yet so let's just i think i made too many pickaxes to be fair so i think we'll be fine okay there we go don't want to dig that buy in the sand biome Okay, what's those sounds? Okay. Whoops. 
I don't know why, but I heard slime, and I know that's not even possible. Okay, we'll be fine. Well, we will be fine. Oh my gosh, that scared me so much. Okay, 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 okay. We'll be fine. Where's the rest of the cave? Where is, there it is, there it is. Found the cave, cave spotted, okay. Where's the zombie? I definitely hear a zombie. I don't see one. Okay, we, if we, if there is a zombie, we need a quick escape route. Oh, it's not even down here. Well, that was a complete waste of my time. Okay, well, there's obviously a cave below us, but I'm not... Oh, is that? That's my stairway. Okay. Not brave enough to explore right now. So, find a new cave. A different cave. Some more iron would be... Ooh, yeah, that's normal cave. These sand caves are always just so dangerous, because any second... Well, really. Nah, it's kind of like a... Whatever. But if you place a block in the wrong place, the whole ceiling can come crumbling on top of you, and it's dangerous. So we're just gonna not mine in the desert. Okay, so I guess we'll go... Where should we go? Don't know anywhere to go. We can just... We'll just go exploring a little bit. Not like major exploring, not like, like an exploring day, but just a little bit of exploring so we can go and get things that we need in mind that we hopefully find. Let's get the sugar cake too, because that can give us cake. And pumpkin pie and paper. Pretty sure that's all that's good for, though. But it's okay. What's that pink in the distance? Is that red? Oh, it's just a mushroom. Huh. Nothing that we're not used to. Because, you know, we live in one of those biomes. Which is actually surprisingly being really safe. I thought it was going to be weird. Because I know, like, no cows and sheep. You can't farm there. You can't have a tree farm. But it's keeping us away from, like, a lot of mobs that would normally be spawning. So, I'm pretty happy with that. Oh, yay! Little flowers that we can decorate with. And make pink dye. We so desire, but we need bones. Don't know why bones are so good for so many things, but, like, so... Just, uh, to get. You know, like, I just don't like... I mean, I only thing I like killing... Enderman's a pain to kill. And when they die, the sound they make is absolutely awful. Creepers, if I was... If I have a bow, creepers, I don't mind. Yeah, um, zombies are not bad at all, obviously. Um, I don't know why I got so scared earlier, but whatever. But just skeletons are the one where it's like, no matter what, they can still kill you. Oh, and witches, and baby zombies. I can't stand any of those. Oh my gosh, look at all those trees. They're so big. I can't stand any of those as creatures of the world. They're just awful little things that are just... Ooh, what's this? Oh, lava pit. Duh. Obviously. Okay. What did I think? Oh, yeah. They're awful. They're so bad. I just can't. Oh, yay! Plains biome! Hopefully, we can find a cave down there. I am not going to a cave in the desert. Okay. Let's head this way and find something, hopefully. If not, there's some, a few holes in that biome. These biomes are so weird. Like, I, this world is just so cool. Like, look at all the different bi- Like, I know in Xbox the biomes are, like, smaller. We don't need this shovel right now. The biomes are smaller, and so, like, well, it's just you get more in a compacted space, which, like, sometimes leads to awesome things like- Why can't I get the super claw? Okay. Awesome things like that, which is just so cool. You also gotta keep watch on the day, which is almost night. Okay. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Is there any sheep? Oh my gosh, a swamp biome. I love these biomes. This is my favorite biome by far. I love it. The only downside is there are no parrots, and hopefully we can find some sheep so we can make a bed and not die, which would be nice. If not, oh, we're probably going to die. Oh no. Oh, 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 our old house. Old house. Did we take the bed? We took the bed. Okay, we're just going to try and run back home. Run back home, and then we'll come out for another adventure adventure and then hopefully and then we'll grab a bed or make some shears or something let's just head back and oh my gosh we need food this is all so annoying just to stop just to grab food okay now let's run home let's run back let's just run 
Hopefully nothing spawns, because if something spawns, that is going to be terrifying. Uh, I don't know what I would do. Okay. Um. Oh my gosh, hopefully we didn't lose our house. I know we're pretty far from our house to just run there and be okay. Uh, this, is, this is not good. This is not good. We don't want to die, which isn't obvious. And all we have is a stone sword and leather boots, which is not going to make us last very long. Especially in the desert, which is one of the most dangerous biomes. <sighs> Deserts, I mean, in my opinion. I don't know if it's, like, officially one of the most dangerous biomes, but I think it is. Just because, like, it's so dark. There's no water. I know this is the best place for Endermen to spawn. I know that for a fact. So, it's the best place for Endermen to spawn. And there's, like... I mean, it's not that great. No. They have those, uh, the husk, I think they're called. Husk? I don't know. But I'm, that's 100% right. But it's the biome, which is this. Why is nothing spawning? That's weird. Okay, whatever. Not complaining. Um, they're like zombies that have like these special helmets. So they're a bit stronger than zombies. And um, they only spawn in the desert, I do believe. And they are just awful because they spawn. They're just like normal zombies. So they're just as easy-ish to kill. But in the day, they are still there. So they're kind of like baby zombies. But a little bit more evil because they're grown up. I wonder if there's baby husks. Those would be terrifying. Like, those would be awful. Um, that, that sounds like a nightmare to me. Absolute nightmare. So there's our house in the distance. We need to light up our area a little bit more. Do we have any more? We don't have any more torches. Let's just work on the house for the rest. Because we have enough iron to be able to make some decent armor and some good weapons. And I'm not complaining. And so we're just going to keep it with that. Maybe we can make some blue boots instead, because we have blue dye. And I do not feel like getting a bones. Unless we have a bone in the chest, which we might. Let's just look in our chest. We'll see if there's a bone. And if there's not, we'll make our boots blue instead of pink. And then our next boots will be pink. Okay. We need torches. But let's just go to bed first. Okay. And we wake up in the morning normally and let's see what there is oh is that a skeleton we can take it on that's a zombie villager it's not a husk but we can take him on okay we're gonna go from this way okay died we're gonna go from its back and we have the advantage because we're on land and being in land is faster than being in the water but we don't want it to see us Okay. I really love this texture pack. Everything just looks so nice. Okay. Oh, it's saw me. Oh, no, 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 no. You are gonna win this, and you will give me a bone. You give me a bone. You give me a bone? Oh, two bones. Okay, we're good. Let's go back up. Uh, okay. We survived. We got two bones. So we can make some pink boots, which is amazing. If we can find any more skeletons, that's probably the best way to take them out. Like, when they're about to die, but not really, they jump in water, so they're already, like, low health. And there's not really any mobs around it anyways. That's, that's the best way to take out a skeleton, which we discovered. Oh my gosh, we just threw my sword. Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. <laughs> I always do that. Like, I accidentally hit the throwing button instead of, like, any other button. I don't know why. Okay, so, I'm just going to smelt this. We need this coal. Okay, we're going to put this coal in. Oh, we don't need that beef right now. I'm going to put three pieces in. Because we need to make some tor whoops, torches. Okay, now we need to make our, wait, I don't know if we can make our boots. Okay, we're just going to try it and see if it works. So let's, how do you dye it? Uh, how do you dye this? Okay, wait, we need to go. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, okay. I don't know how to do that. Okay. Is there fireworks? No, B, I don't even know how to make fireworks. Okay, here's some other. Oh, that's how you dye them. Okay. So now we need to make our dye. Where's the dye? Here's the dye. Okay, so we need to make some red, some bone meal, and make some pink, and then we can go... Down to here. Color we want pink. A. 
Um, you can't use used boots. That's awful. Okay, well, guess we'll just wear these. Sad. It's, it's kind of sad, but it's okay. It's okay. We'll make pink ones later. I guess, um, let's see how much iron we have. So first things first, we need a sword. So let's get a sword first, an iron sword. Okay, so we just upgraded our weapon, which is one of the first things we needed to do. So now we can defend better. If we get one, two, let's try to get a tunic next. But I think we have enough to do, yeah. But then we'll have four left over, which makes, we can't do anything with. We can make some shears. That would be nice. And we can try this bone. Whoops, on the wrong flesh. This bone on a nearby dog. Okay. Hopefully we can find the dog that I've been trying to feed bones to, but it's being so stubborn and just not doing anything. <sighs> so mean. Okay, where is that dog? Oh my gosh, this bone looks huge. Oh my. Oh, that was high style. Okay, please be my friend. Or don't. You know, you could be like that too. I don't like dogs. They're not friendly. Well, they are friendly. I don't like wolves. Dogs are friendly. Wolves aren't. They're just like, hey, I know you want me to be my friend, but I'm gonna play hard to get. Because you wanna know why? Because I mean to everything. That's why. Hopefully that dog doesn't come over here. These poor sheepy will die. Okay. Is there any caves over here? I mean, because it would be nice just to get a little bit more iron, but I'm not gonna, like, make, like, a huge amount of effort to get it. I'm just gonna kind of, like, search the area. Oh my gosh, we can get some more flowers! We can decorate everywhere. Okay. Tons of flowers. We got some... I forget what these are called. These daisies look cool. And this texture pack. I mean, they're, like, really square. Like, I know my everything in Minecraft is, like, square. But they're like extra square, which I don't mind. They actually look really cool. I think I just like it because it's like different from what I usually use, you know? So like when you normally do flowers, you're normally expecting like the basic Minecraft, well, not basic, well, the Minecraft flowers that you normally use. And so when they just look a little different, it just, you like it because it's just different than what you're used to. It's just a little change that's not going to really change the game much, but it's enough to like be happy with it. So let's go put these back. Um, we're not going to find any skeletons or McKay's anytime soon. Oh, I lied. Here's a cave. Oh, no, not a cave. That's just one of those, like, stupid little water ditches. Oh, I hate those. They're so annoying because you think you actually found something. But then it's just a load of water. Like, literally. Just, like, a puddle of water and this, like, little hole in the ground. And it's pointless. It doesn't even make any sense why it would be there. And it's just like, hey, I'm going to trick you into thinking of something great, but I'm not. I'm just really a hole in the ground. It just stinks. It's awful. I also want to separate our island from this island. So, like, I think we should make the river go this way. And then on this part of the uh, grass, we can just make, like, a normal garden. And, which I think would look nice. And maybe we can, like, fence it all in or something. I don't know. Make it look nice. We'll eventually do. We just need a lot more materials, but that's okay. So let's make our chest plate. Let's do that now. Here we go, chest plate. Um, we can't make pants. We need three more pieces. So then let's make some shears. And we can start farming next time because we have a good enough materials to start doing that. Oh, we want to put this on. We've got enough materials to start doing that and be safe enough where we could do that so i think what i'm gonna do is it'll be kind of boring so i won't do this like normal thing but oh no wrong button there we go i think i'm gonna make it so this biome ends like here like here ish Put this wood to mark it and then this will all be like that green grass and then we can section off the island, which will be a lot of work and will happen over time very gradually. But I think it will look really, really nice. So, yeah, we're going to do that. Um, but that's the end of this um, episode. There will be um, more to come. And, yeah, so I'm going to start by the front with our dog, Bubblegum, Cotton Candy. Oh, my gosh, why did I forget my dog's name? 
Was it bubblegum or cotton candy? I think it was cotton candy. Cotton candy. Not, I just changed your name. Now it is cotton candy. 